morning. Police inquiries. How can I help? Yeah, hi. I hope you can. Um, I'm in a situation where I'm in a hotel and there was a man with two girls who, one of them was definitely overage, one was dressed in a school uniform and was definitely underage. What time was this? This is like one o'clock in the morning. And she just didn't look comfortable. She wasn't joining in any of the laughing that the other two were doing, but she was just playing with her drink and not not engaging with them both and, and just didn't look comfortable. I just kept watching her out the corner of my eye because she just looked so uncomfortable and just not, not at ease and playing with her hair. I remember her twiddling her hair a lot. And um, yeah, she just, she just didn't seem right and it just concerned me. I did mention it to um, the receptionist and just sort of said, is this normal? Is this sort of, is it normal to have a girl in uniform sat in your bar? And he said, no, no, it does seem a bit odd. Um, he didn't, he said he wasn't going to do anything about it. He just sort of shrugged. He didn't seem to know what to do. I just carried on watching them. They were very, it was obvious they were aware that I was watching them. He'd been to call a taxi. And when the girls got up to leave to get into the taxi, I went and spoke to them. I just, she just looked uncomfortable and I just wanted to check she was okay. So I went and asked. Um, the older girl was the one that did most of the talking and they told me that it was okay, they were fine. And then they went and got in the taxi and he came over to talk to me to tell me that I had nothing to worry about and that, um, that they were leaving and he was going to bed. It felt even stranger that he told me that there was nothing to worry about. It just didn't feel right. I couldn't settle, I couldn't get the picture of her out of my head. That could be my daughter in a few years' time and it would be nice if someone did something about that. So I just kept thinking that I needed to make a call. I couldn't settle. Um, so eventually I decided that I'd phone 101 and, um, and, and let them know what was going on. Good morning, police inquiries. How can I help?